Welcome back to The Legend of Zelda, Link to the Past Let's Play. I'm Bud Gaines, also known as Wrinkles Warrior. And this time I'm gonna try not to get a glitch game. Not that I tried to last time, but it happened. And apparently I'm gonna fall in that hole and die. Bring me to life. That's all I can say. Bring me back to life. Insert Evanescence song here. Oh. Why, thank you, fairy. <laughs> Don't ask. I'm in a good mood. I got my headset working okay, I guess, from the last recording. It sounds fine. And I'm not glitching and I'm not falling into holes or shit like that. Just dying. Just dying. That's it. Alright. So, I was supposed to be going back and getting that key that I missed. Which I kind of need. So let's go back and do that right now. And hope I can get to the other side quickly. Move this. I'll try not to die so much this time. But yeah, I have to backtrack a, just a little bit back and down some hall and... Shouldn't take too long. Maybe I'll actually be able to finish this dungeon today. But yeah, I kind of need this key. And I'm stupid and I should have went to the left and picked it up to begin with, but... I didn't because I'm slow and I... Apparently I'm on drugs or something. No, I'm not really on drugs, but... It works. It's a good excuse. I believe that's a rupee. I believe that's a heart. Once you hit that switch on the other side, that would be a chest where I was just at a minute ago. And inside is our small key that we're missing. Alright. Time to go back. I don't want to waste my bomb, so I'm going to switch to my boomerang. Uh, where is that? It's that top corner one? Yeah. Just the power of love. Don't ask, that was random. Alright. So far, so good. No glitch game, no anything like that. Hopefully it will stay this way. If not, I will have to kick some ass. Or get my ass kicked. Whichever one it is. Whichever one's is appropriate. Let's see what I can do. I think I need to be over on that side, but it's a little hard to do at the moment. Kill that. Leap! Run, Link, run like you never run before! Well, you probably have ran like this before, but... Yeah, now I'm stuck. <laughs> Apparently I'm not. Never mind. Will they respawn somewhere else? Yay! Yeah, this is usually where I get my ass kicked. As you've seen. I just stayed on that skull that was protecting me from falling in. Ha, and I still kicked your ass, man. Ah, oh, damn it. Alright, so, that kinda sucked. If I hit that switch, those other blocks will come back up. It shouldn't be taking this long. <laughs> Apparently it's going to take forever for me. Maybe if I just go through the other side. Which I should have thought of before. Instead of 
looking around like a retard. I should have just came back over here and ran over here and ran up here. Just wasting time. I'm enjoying being able to talk clearly on here. Alright, but we still have to run to the other side. Alright, there we go. Throw that away. Run past these guys. If you can kill them, good. If not, whatever. You kind of have to be quick, so... Door! Inside the maze-like structure, which I really don't feel like doing. Watch out for the guys that breathe fire. Don't run into them like I did. Be smart. Grab this chest of three bombs. that thing. Do they have names? Th that creature there? I don't think I've ever figured out what his name was. Yeah, there's that key, and I think I need my bombs now. Yeah, I need bombs. Let's take us back to where that falling bridge area was. Which is good, because we need what's over there. In the area, not on the bridge. And we get the magic hammer. But if you watch my other video, you already know you get the magic hammer. That one just went up because it was a glitch type. Alright, so let me just work my way back through here. Hopefully that won't take too long and I won't get attacked by that fire-breathing menace. I wonder if the red shield deflects those fireballs. I don't want to find out. You can keep them. I don't want to find out if it deflects them or not. You can keep them. Alright, turtles. Get hammered. I think I'm going the wrong way. Whatever. It'll work for now. If this video runs over, sorry. It kind of has to be done. I was hoping to get it done earlier, but technical difficulties ensued and I had to not do it. So I decided to wait and re record it and put it out. This is the easiest way I found to deal with that guy. Or throw a bomb at him, but I sucked at that the other day. Kind of sucks I'm already down to one heart, but I will live. I will survive. Why? Because I have fairies, which I hope I don't have to use too many more of. I hate this guy, this, this dungeon fight, as you saw if you watched the other one. I died. But I had to re-record that one anyway, and wasn't too worried about it. So let's not count that one, it's just uploaded because it it was a funny video. That's about it. Don't hold it against me that that video showed me dying at the end of it for good. Alright, anyway, let's continue on into this dungeon, not with the ice rod, thank you. Do this. Did you guys wait to take that one out? I thought I grabbed those arrows down there. Anyway. More arrows! Maybe I should have put that up. Alright, do I have the right... weapon out? No, I do not. Come here, hammer. I flipped him over. That's the sound a hammer makes? I don't think so. A bomb. A bomb. A door. 
Turtle, 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 turtle. What the hell? That sucked. It wouldn't let me swing my hammer. Okay, I'll come back to life now. Probably wouldn't let me swing it because I was in the doorway when he decided he's going to run at me. Alright, so now my most hated part of this area. All the turtle soup that I don't get to have because I'm going to get killed. No, I've never had turtle soup. I like turtles. It's not these. Alright, the door opened. That just lights up the area. Continue on. And I believe it's this one over here. Let me light these and see if there's anything in here before I continue. Oh, there's a turtle. Maybe I should just continue. I don't see any cracked walls, so I guess there's nothing in there. Ah. Thank you. Alright. Now we're back in this room with even more turtles. We're gonna kick my ass if I don't run away. Alright. Now we get to fight this guy. Uh, I believe his name is Helmosaur. Who usually kicks my ass pretty well. Watch out for his tail. Watch out for his fire breath. I didn't do too well that last time. No, how many hits it takes to kill his mask. Fireball, fireball breath, splits up, splits up again. Again, really? Already? Shit. Hey, Dark World, there's too much damage to you. Now, if you can do good, just smack that crystal on his forehead. Shove a sword up his face. I believe is the correct term. There you go. Alright, and that's defeating... I believe his name is Helmosaur. I could be wrong. And he dropped a heart piece, which I desperately need because I suck. And you get your first crystal. All that in just 13 minutes. If I would have got lost, it would have took less time and I could have continued on. Now she's gonna talk. And while she talks, I'll send a text message. Anyway. So now he's trying to open a larger gate between the castle, but it's not done yet. And they come together, they can break the barrier around Ganon's hiding spot. I will tell you where the other girls are being held. I believe you will destroy Ganon. I will return to my original form at that time. Thank you for marking my map, Lady of the Crystal. Do I understand? Yes. May the way of the hero lead you to the Triforce. That's kind of, a, I guess, the Zelda way of saying, may the Force be with you. Are you still? Yep, there we go. Alright, so. I didn't do too bad in there, though I got lost and was low energy in the beginning. We still managed to finish it and get ourselves a pizza heart and a crystal. Alright, I guess after this it's time to do some more collection, I believe, and continue on to the second dungeon of Dark World. Join me next time, I am Bud Gaines, also known as Rankless Warrior. Thanks for watching, come back when the episode comes out. Peace out, everyone.